Slideshow 123 223rds Audi Grand Sphere Audi's highlight will probably be the Grand Sphere, as the brand has already officially confirmed. The large sedan is one of the three spheres that Audi intends to present in the near future. The Grand Sphere is apparently a design study of a luxury vehicle that could one day inherit the A8 but with a significantly different body. Above all, Audi wants to show the interior. It should of course be classy, but it should also be possible to see what the interior of an autonomously driving car at level 4 could look like. 23 BMW at the IAA BMW should show a strong presence at the IAA, a matter of honor for a Munich brand at a Munich auto show. You don't just want to be present on the exhibition grounds, at the so-called summit in the east of the city, but throughout the city. Mini will set up camp on Lenbachplatz, BMW on Max Joseph Platz in front of the magnificent backdrop of the opera. On the blue lane between the exhibition center and the city center, the fuel cell vehicle BMW i Hydrogen Next, based on the X5, will be able to be experienced as a shuttle vehicle. In the BMW Welt near the Olympic Park you can marvel at the current model range from BMW and visit a new exhibition on the topics of electromobility, sustainability and recycling management in the BMW Museum next door. It is still speculative whether BMW will show surprises such as the BMW iX1 or the new electric 7 series, i7, in addition to the announced models. 423rds BMW CEO 4, BMW Motorrad will be represented at the IAA with the new CEO 4, which was presented at the beginning of July. The chic and somewhat futuristic designed electric scooter offers a top speed of 120 km per hour and a range of 130 km. The standard equipment includes a 10. 25-inch display with integrated map navigation and connectivity. An LED headlight and an LED rear light are also standard, with adaptive headlights as an option. 523rds BMW i4 The i4 electric sedan is one of the confirmed exhibits at the IAA. One of the highlights of the four-door model based on the new 4 Series Grand Coupe is the astonishing range of up to 590 km according to the WLTP standard. The car will probably be on display at the exhibition center, where visitors can see the car live for the first time, and will probably be able to sit down in the car. The car will hit the market in November 2021. 623rds BMW iX The second electric newcomer from BMW can also be seen at the fair. Like the i4, the iX will also start in November. Although the car has the format of the X5, albeit with a lower height, it is said to be based on a new electric platform. Here, too, BMW amazes with a long range of up to 630 kilometers. At the fair, you will probably find out more about the previously announced M50 top version, of which only the system output of 440 kilowatts is known so far. 723rds Dacia at the IAA Dacia will present itself on a hip stand on Munich's Königsplatz. The classicist square, where Hitler once held large parades with thousands of soldiers and other uniformed men, has now become a popular place to stay for young people with large green spaces. The brand's new lettering with fairly angular letters will probably also be visible at the stand. Dacia is showing its entire model range there, including the new seven-seater, which has already been spotted by spy photographers. It will also be presented in the entrance area of the exhibition grounds. The highlight for electric car fans, however, is the new Dacia Spring, but more on that in the next picture. 823rds Dacia Spring Electric The Spring Electric is described by Dacia as the cheapest electric car on the market, and with a base price of around €20,000, before funding. That's probably the case. The only three. 73 meter long SUV is mainly intended as a city car, because the range is just 230 kilometers. Five Dacia Spring are said to be on the blue lane. Visitors to the IAA can not only be chauffeured but also drive the electric car themselves.
923 Mercedes AMG EQE In the meantime, Mercedes has confirmed that the new EQE will also be shown at the IAA. The assumption was obvious since the electric sedan was to be unveiled in September. Like the EQS, the car is based on a dedicated electric car platform called Electric Vehicle Architecture, EVA. The SUV variants of the two newcomers will also be based on this, but they are not expected until 2022. 1023rds Mini Vision Urbanaut The main attraction for Mini at the IAA is the Urbanaut Study, a futuristic van for the city of the future, which is to be physically experienced for the first time as a vehicle model for visitors to the open space at the IAA, probably on Lenbachplatz. The electrically powered car relies on sustainable materials in the interior. Visitors can marvel at the rotating driver's seat, the retractable dashboard, which becomes a daybed, as well as the retractable steering wheel and the opening windscreen. 1123rds Rianult 5 prototype on September 7. In addition to the electric Megane, the new R5 prototype will also be on display, and it is sure to attract attention. The small electric car was already the absolute highlight at the, not poor in announcements and information otherwise, Renault press conference in January 2021. When it will be launched on the market is not yet officially known, but from the manufacturer's instructions, it can be concluded that it will not be so far until the end of 2023. Then you will probably get to see the rather bulky looking crossover for the first time without the black-white-yellow camouflage film. Like the Nissan Ariya, the electric Megane is based on the CMF EV electric platform. It enables vehicle presentations as well as talk shows. The mobility brand Mobilize will be presented at the stand on September 8th. On September 9th, Renault will be showing its e-tech models there, which also include plug-in hybrids. The highlights from Renault, however, are two new models that are also among the highlights of the fair, but more about that in a moment. He also revealed that the car will be shown as a study at the IAA. The allegedly 4-meter-long SUV will be based on the Sustainable Experience Architecture, C, of the Chinese Geely Group, which will also produce the car in China. Probably from 2022 on, the, so far nameless, Newcomer will then compete against Opel Mokka E, Hyundai Kona Electric and Kia e Soul. 1523rds Toyota BZ4X1 can still speculate about whether Toyota will show the BZ4X at the IAA. The car is the first of seven BZ series models to be launched by 2025. 1623rds Mercedes EQS Mercedes is showing the EQS at the IAA, the latest electric car with the star, which we have known since the unveiling in April. The data from two versions called EQS 450 Plus and EQS 584 Matic are also known. A third version, a performance model with up to 560 kilowatts has already been announced. And it is precisely this AMG variant that will probably also be in Munich. Perhaps on this occasion, we will also find out when the EQS will be available on the market because that is not yet officially known. One speaks of August or Autumn 2021. 1723rds Microlino The Swiss company Micro is represented at the IAA, and rumor has it that it is showing the production version of the Microlino 2. Zero at the show. Thanks for watching. Please like my video and subscribe EVpedia for more electronic vehicle news and updates.